Before we start this video, we want to give a quick shout out to our special $50 Ultimate Power patron, Party God Douglas Productions. If you're a fan of Steven Universe, he's got lots of Steven Universe theories just like Gus and Steven Universe memes. Because let's be honest, we're all meme lords here. Let's keep it real. And if you like fan fiction, video game reviews, and, well, more memes, then there is something there for you too. So you can go check out Party God Douglas Productions in the description down below. He's really funny. Go check him out. And now, on to the topic at hand. What is going on guys? This is Michael Williams from Cartoon Universe and this is going to be a quick Steven Universe discussion video for the next special that's coming out on May 5th. We thought it might be May 1st for Latin America. That ended up not being the case. So it's going to be May 5th and or was it 7th? It was one one of one of the Mays, man. I can't I can't keep track anymore. But the big thing is obviously the stuff that we got in the promos. We got Pearl silhouette drawing a sword. We got Steven on the moon base. A lot of craziness happening. And everyone's asking, what's gonna happen? Did Pearl really shatter Pink Diamond? Are they really kind of exploring that possibility? What's going on? What's happening? And I just want to bring up the possibility. Just a possibility. Don't want to be a Debbie Downer, but. Um, we, we might not learn anything. So if you remember the last string of Steven Universe episodes that we got, uh, we ended up not learning anything. And this was a really big L for Cartoon Network because uh, the, main, the main reason people were really upset by this was because Cartoon Network was like, oh, all your questions will be answered, all the mysteries will be solved, and they showed all these diamonds, and then we learned literally nothing at all. Uh, we got a recap of Rose Quartz, and it's not that the episodes were bad, that wasn't the issue. The issue was that we didn't actually get that promise that we were going to get all of our questions answered and everything was going to be fine and dandy. So I'm worried that we're getting baited again with this Pearl silhouette. I feel like it might end up not being anything. Everyone's wondering what it means, what could it be, and don't get me wrong, it absolutely could be something. And I think regardless, these episodes are probably going to be very good. Going to get some lapis development, which I'm very excited for. But we might not learn something. And this has been a problem with Steven Universe's pacing as a whole. has been a big criticism is that their pacing is very slow and we don't really get a lot of payoffs or reveals or anything. And it's been quite a while. I mean, even Pink Diamond's reveal wasn't even an actual Pink Diamond reveal. It was mostly Stevani. It was mostly set through Stevani. We don't know what she sounds like or anything like that. And then the next time we saw Pink Diamond, she was all minimalistic and through the voice of Garnet. So we still really have not gotten a super, super relevant and crazy Pink Diamond reveal yet. So I think that th there, this is an issue uh, with the series because, again, the last few episodes were not bad by any stretch. They were all very entertaining, very well done, but it just was kind of disappointing because we were promised, hey, you're going to get all your questions answered, and then we didn't get anything revealed at all. So it just kind of left a bad taste in a lot of people's mouths. So I'm, I am concerned uh, that this might happen again. And if it does, then what? what when are we going to learn something? Because we have no, I don't even think we know what's coming after this. I don't think we know yet when we're going to get more Steven Universe episodes. So what does that mean if this whole thing ends up being some sort of bait or another tease? They just keep teasing us, teasing us, teasing us, which to some degree, you know, gets us talking a lot and gets us theorizing a lot. I mean, there's been dozens of Pink Diamond theories. There's literally a theory that Rose is Pink Diamond, that Rose shattered Pink Diamond, Rose didn't shatter Pink Diamond, Pearl shattered Pink Diamond, one of the diamonds shattered Pink Diamond, one of the diamonds worked with Rose to shatter Pink Diamond, Pink Diamond shattered herself and it framed Rose Quartz. Lion is Pink Diamond, Pink Diamond shards in the chest, Pink Diamond shards are scattered around the world, Pink Diamond shards are in the temple. There's like so many different theories just for Pink Diamond and I think uh, the Cruniverse obviously did a very good job in getting us to think of every single possible ability uh, but then it leaves the question of what's left after this what are we gonna where do we go from this point what 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 can they reveal that is really gonna throw us off guard that we haven't already guessed Rebecca sugar did mention in an interview I don't remember which one but she did mention that she doesn't necessarily want the uh, series to feel like oh I never saw that coming she wants the mysteries to be kind of hinted at and then once they are revealed she wants more of a aha I knew it feeling more so than a wow that's crazy I didn't think that was gonna happen feeling so it's possible that any of these possibilities are probably going to happen and they're not actually trying to misdirect us into something else. So that's a thing, but I'm kind of rambling at this point. I'm just, I'm just expressing my concern 
and just putting the possibility out there that we might actually not learn anything. And I just kind of want to give a warning to everybody because everyone was very disappointed, rightfully so, because they did promise we were going to get all of our questions answered. But I want to give people a warning uh, from the last time that we may not actually get any major reveals. I think these episodes are still going to be great. I think we're going to get some good pro development, most likely, even if we don't get a super crazy backstory for her. I think we're going to get some great lapis development. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a good time, but I just don't want people to be disappointed because we might not actually learn anything about Pink Diamonds or Pink Diamonds Murder or Pearl's backstory. And it's a shame because it's been five seasons and we still do not know Pearl's backstory. So we are about overdue and it seems like they're very much leading into it. So we'll have to wait and see. Obviously, I'm hoping something big happens and we could probably talk about that in the next coming days. But for now, I'm just kind of withholding judgment and trying to maintain a moderate hype level because I don't want to get too hype and then get disappointed when nothing super crazy happens. But what do you guys think? Do you think we are going to actually learn something about the Pink Diamond murder? Do you think we're actually going to learn something about Pearl's origins? Let us know in the comments down below. I'd love to hear what you think. And why, why do you think or don't you think we're going to actually learn something of super crazy value? Regardless, like I said, I think it's going to be a great episode. So let us know in the comments down below. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave it a like. We have a lot more coming your way for the next week and then we're gonna be having a lot to talk about hopefully after the episode airs thank you guys so much for tuning in i've been michael williams you've been watching cartoon universe and we'll see you in the next video peace